Yo people, what's up? This is your boy John from ColderIce.com and you know what? Um, here you go. Here's the saying, alright? That a fish will not outgrow its environment. So basically they've always said like, you know, if you put a fish in a small fish bowl, it won't outgrow the fish bowl. Guess what? It's one of my favorite sayings. And so, before I made the video, I decided to, you know, do some research, of course, because I don't like saying stuff that's not true. So, I was doing some research and found that that's not true. Well, actually, it is true. However, here's the deal, is that a fish will basically die before it will grow to full size if its environment is not large enough. You know, I'm from the Midwest. Uh, I was, I was, uh, uh, I, m I moved from Columbus, Ohio. Now I'm in Atlanta, Georgia. And one of the reasons why I moved is because there's this saying that I always have in my head, and it says, "Big fields await the wide awake man." Let me say that again: Big fields await the wide awake man. That is a quote from Elijah Muhammad that I always have playing in my head. And when I visited this city, Atlanta, Georgia, one time, I realized that the fishbowl that I was in, in Ohio, I mean, I'm not dissing it, I visit, I wouldn't live there again, but I literally realized that the fishbowl I was in was too small for me to grow to my full potential and ultimately it would kill me. It wouldn't necessarily kill me personally, physically, but it would kill my spirit and my drive because there was just not enough space for me to expand in. How does that relate to business? Look, there have been several events this year. Um, a lot of business conventions or a lot of people are, are, are able to purchase different training courses or whatever. And I hear, I might suggest, hey, you should be at this event or you should come to this event or this, that, and the other. And one of the things that people, you know, always say is, well, you know, uh, I can't afford to do that. And I'm not saying that the economy is not a real thing. I'm not saying that your pocketbook is not a real thing. But at some point, you have got to figure out how much it's actually costing you by not furthering your education, by not expanding your opportunities, by not venturing out from the comforts of your current fishbowl. That's what a lot of us do. We get comfortable. We complain that we're not growing but we don't actually invest in time we don't make the necessary moves into new atmospheres that will allow us to expand our scope our reach you know if you're attached to one sales platform you can't expand if you're attached to one marketing tool you won't expand at some point you're gonna reach critical mass and at that point after that the amount of food that is available for you to feed on is either going to kill you or you won't be able to sustain much longer so that's why I'm telling you guys you gotta start thinking about this in the way that 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 makes you move you know there are some things that make you move. Do you know sometimes if I if I go to an event and I spend thousands of dollars to get to that event, you better be damn skippy that when I get back, I'm going to put that stuff to practice. Why? Because I spent my hard-earned dollars to get out there, to learn the information, to get the lessons. So when I get home, I'm hella motivated to make sure I implement those things. And from that, from that, I find success. So, yes, a fish will not outgrow its environment. It'll die first. This is your boy John, coldrice.com. I'm out of here, guys. Peace.